Welcome to Solar Punk Life. Today we were going to film for you an episode about solar powered flashlights, but it's raining outside, so we're going to change it up. Today I'm going to share with you a quick tip on how to take a water bottle and turn it into an automatic watering system for your potted plants. So the first thing you need to do is go to your recycling bin and grab as many bottles as you think you might need. Get those all set up and cleaned, take the labels off and set them next to your working area and then gather your tools. You're going to need a lighter, a set of pliers. I like locking pliers myself, a candle and a straight pin. If you don't have exactly these things, I'm sure you can find suitable substitutes that you already have around your house. Once you light the candle, secure the pin with the pliers so that you can heat it up without burning your hands. Once you have all your tools together, make sure you take the caps off of the bottles. It just makes it easier to work with them, in my opinion. Carefully heat the pin with the candle and making sure not to touch the hot pin to yourself use it to puncture three holes in the tops of the bottle cap. You might need to reheat the pen a couple of times. If the pin doesn't go through the cap easily, it's not hot enough. So just take your time and do as many as you think you need. And when you're done, make sure you blow out the candle. Here we've gone outside to the garden where I'm going to fill the bottles up and show you how they're used. I like to use this watering can. It makes it really easy for me to fill about three bottles out of this watering can at a time, uh, but you can fill directly from a hose or you can use a bucket full of water, whatever works for you. I like to give the bottles a squeeze as well to make sure that the holes are actually clear. And as you can see, they shoot out a fine stream when I squeeze them. And that's it. You've created some automatic watering bottles. Now simply invert them and put them into the pots. You might need to make some holes in the dirt to make sure that they stand up straight or even tape them to a stick or something like that to make sure they stay upright. The point is you want to get the bottle cap down in the soil so that as the water drips out, it keeps the soil moist. We hope you've enjoyed this episode of Solar Punk Life. And we ask that you subscribe to our channel and click that notification bell as well to be notified when our next episode drops. And as always, do good, be good. Thanks for watching.